Dodgers. They've now gone 117 consecutive ABs without a home run going back to Kike Hernandez fifth inning blast on Tuesday. Shohei Otani one on one out in the third. Smashes this ball. Forget about it. Marte doesn't even move. It's gone. Two to nothing LA. The 176th of Otani's career. He stands alone for Japanese born sluggers. 176 Major League home runs passing Hideki Matsui. This is really the inning where you try and turn it into a blowout. And even if it gets to four to nothing or five to nothing, that's going to feel like a blowout to the Mets because of the way Glass now is throwing the ball. Goes after the first pitch and rips it into center field for a base hit. Pajas in to score three to nothing. Mookie Betts with an RBI single. Chance at a big inning here. Day after they left, the bases loaded four different times. Freeman pulls one, right field, Marte, dive in the tank, can't get it, and Freeman's in the second with a two-run double. Empty the tank, last hitter. California cool, but there is a killer in there, too. Tyler Glass now trying to go for the knockout blow here. Bases loaded, two gone in the eighth. Struck him out with the high fastball. Tyler Glass now with an exclamation to finish off eight shutout innings. It's a 10 strikeout. Banner day for Tyler Glass now. No score top three. Colton Kowser leads off. Colton Kowser did something last night. At the end of the game, he caught the final out of the game. And then, in his words, yeeted the ball into the fountains. That was Craig Kimbrell's 422nd career save. He's now tied for seventh all time with Billy Wagner. He ran up the tunnel on the third base side, found an usher by the fountains, and made sure that Kimbrell got his souvenir. Kowser drives one out to right center field. Hit high, hit deep. Colton Kowser into the fountains. He threw one there last night. He hit one there today. Jordan Westberg on the next pitch. That's a tank out to left center. Westberg splashes down. And Kowser and Westberg go back to back in the third. The leadoff man in this inning, Caballero. He's now at third and a balk. A balk has been called. Caballero made a little move and saw the hesitation. And Libka, the plate umpire, called the balk. Line drive, it's a base hit to right field. Stanton scores. Here comes Rizzo. He'll score. Torres goes to third. It's a big two-run single for Verdugo. And the Yankees lead three to one. And a base hit punch through the middle. Here comes Rosario. He will score. And the Rays make it a one run game. Curtis Mead comes through, picking up his first run batted end of the year. Victor Gonzalez to try to close this out. This will be his ninth game. Runner goes up the middle, knocked down by Gonzalez. Scrambles after, fires to first. They got him. Ball game's over, and the Yankees win. Ozuna's hit streak came to an end last night at 17, still the longest in his career, but he's reached base safely in 18 straight games. 2-0, and he hits one high in the air towards deep right center, sprinting back to Veras, to the wall, and it ain't sticking around. It's a three-run home run. Ozuna leading the demolition squad tonight with a three-run bomb in the first inning. The 1-1 is pulled high and deep into right field. Acuna going back. And he will watch it sail into the chop house. Evan Carter hits his third home run of the season. A blast to straightaway right. He gets Texas on the board here at 3-1. to one. Runners do move up. Second and third. Here's Kisner. He singled his first time up. Can tie it with a single. Instead, he launches one to left. It is deep, and it is out of here. Andrew Kisner's first of the year. He can touch them all. And the Rangers have gone back on top. And the pitch is hit high and deep into right field. Acuna will watch this one as it sails into the chop house. Opposite field home run for Adolis Garcia. The Rangers do indeed add on. One down here in the second inning. Dalton Varsho stands in. High fly ball down the right field line. Fernando makes his way over to foul ground into a slide. Fernando makes the catch. Oh, go on. Fly ball left field. Back goes Varsho at the wall. It's gone. 
Bogey goes boom, and it's tied 2 2. One for three day, singled. His last time up sends one towards right center field. Fernando up into the air to make the catch. That's not Superman, that's Fernando Tatis Jr. Celebration going on down on the field. I'm not sure if you can see it. Kyle Schwarber launches one to deep right field toward the pole. It is gone. Second deck home run for Schwarber. It's a Schwarbaum on the Fanatics' birthday. And a strike three call. That'll wrap up this eighth inning. Seven strikeouts for Aaron Nola. Turnbull, Wheeler, Nola. Seven innings or more, three consecutive starts. Swing to the it's a high drive to right field. Back onto the warning track, back at the wall, and goodbye! A soaring two-run homer, and he has put the Giants ahead. Got him. They're going to say he fouled it on play. Bailey doesn't think so. Well, it's not a reviewable play. What it is, this is a frustrating play. Knuckle curveball, straight down bite. Jake holds it first. Newman with a base hit. Moreno will score. McCarthy digging for third. Jake's going to get there. And Kevin Newman's at second base. It's 4 2 Diamond Bends. And Melvin is still barking at Stu Sherwater, and he's been ejected. Now they're talking about the noise that Melvin did not think that that foul ball made because he didn't think it was touched. And new bar to center field. Perkins giving it a run. Still back. Perkins leaps. He got it. Blake Perkins, a superhero act out in center field. Two men in scoring position for Miller. Infield comes up. Line drive base hit Owen Miller. That'll score two. The local kid Owen Miller delivers for the Brewers. And Garcia with a base hit up the middle. Luis Garcia. The running nets are on top by three. And that ball's well hit to left by Nick Senzel. See you later. Eight strikeouts in seven shutout innings for this rookie, Mitchell Parker. He's given up a whopping seven home runs already this year and 24 RBI. There's a fly ball way out towards center field. That's another one. By My line. goodness. Got every last bit of it. That's going to get down for a base hit. Bell will go all the way to third base. Sanchez stops at first. That's an RBI single for Jesus Sanchez. And a line drive base hit to right field. That'll tie the ball game. And Charlie Blackman will get to third. Ryan McMahon has a chance to walk it off with the Rockies. And a bouncing ball left side. Knocked down, but not no play. And the Rockies walk it off. Deep drive out towards right center field. It's back and it bangs off the very top of the high wall. Rayleigh is in. Arias is right behind him. Zavala's pedal into the plate. It's a bases clearing triple. J.P. Crawford. Into center field. Dropping, dropping, dropping. Down for a base hit. Duran will score. Ref Snyder to third and the Sox are in front. And Abreu just keeps on swinging it. Shattered bat hits that one toward the gap. That's going to drop down for a base hit. Here comes Ref Snyder rounding. And into second base goes Abreu with his third hit today. Well hit. Left center. Off the wall. Two run double. Encarnacion strand. And a 2 nothing Reds lead. Well hit center field. Trout flying back. Misses the ball. He crashes down, and Carnacion Strand scores. Candelario gallops for third. Here's Will Brennan. Chill Will Brennan. Uh-oh. Right field. Back. Butler. He's out of room. It's out of here. How do you like them apples? Right to right field. It's that. deep. It's all the way onto the warning track. It's up against the walls. Josh Naylor delivers. Left field, this one's deep, going back. Martin looking up, and it's gone! A home run! Buddy Kennedy with a two-run shot, and the Tigers take a 4-0 lead. For more on these and other stories, keep it locked to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.